Okay, good morning. I'm feeling very groggy this morning. And I woke up to rain, so that's nice. Um, and I realized today is a leg day. So I was all excited on my way to gym. And then I was like, oh, what am I doing? To oh, it's leg day. Uh, anyway, we'll get it done. I think I'll do my half an hour on the treadmill first, though, before it. Because I don't think there'll be anything worse than doing a bunch of heavy squats and leg stuff and then running on the treadmill. That sounds like a nightmare. Whereas the treadmill doesn't make my legs sore, so I can do that first and then do my leg day. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay, that was pretty good. A uh, little run and then leg day. Not my favorite day in the gym, I'm not going to lie. But every time after you leave gym, I would like to find one person that doesn't feel like they have more energy or in a good mood once they leave gym. Try me. Because you can't find it. Literally, going to gym just boosts your mood. And running in the morning also, I found out what it does. It kind of gets a lot of oxygen in your brain, so you're in a pretty high vibrational state when you're working. So that's another benefit of running in the morning. Uh, it's going to be a bit of a challenge in Joe Bug because there's no gyms around that are close to where I'm staying. So I think I might have to act do actual runs in the morning, which is cool because where we're staying is quite nice. Nice roads around there, safe. So yeah, I'll be able to go on some actual runs in Joe Bug. Anyways, enough blathering. I've got to go and get my coffee now. So yeah. Okay, I've got my coffee, but kind of gutted because the weather's been absolute rubbish this week. Like I wanted to suntan every day and yes, it was the only day I could. It's just been this weird cloudy mixture with sun and rain. So ugh, it is what it is, I guess. I thought that shot was gonna look so cool, but it looked kind of rubbish, didn't it? <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna get to work now. It's about, yeah, it's half past eight. So let's get right into it. All right, lunch is done now. Time to put this my personal phone away because I've got more work to do. So yeah, I'm putting you guys in this cupboard here. Completely lost track of time. It's literally been three hours since I got back to work. Um, just being hounded by with price objections and stuff. So been handling all of those and just a lot, like I said earlier on, a lot of people have started replying to the follow-up. So just the sheer amount of replies I'm getting is insane. Um, but now I'm just going to change up the scenery a little bit and I'm going to go work at the coffee shop across the road just to keep it moving, keep me on my toes. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay, first call of the day booked. It's, uh, it's four o'clock, so quite a late, late start to booking calls, but that's all right. Still getting it done. And like I said, just a lot of conversations going on, but shame. This uh, lady I booked in now, she's really sweet, like... I don't know, I treated the messaging kind of different with this conversation. It just flowed a lot better. And like, I built a lot of rapport in, in that in that conversation. And she was like, she noticed it, she picked up and she was like, oh, I can feel the personality shining through these messages. Unlike a lot of other people who are blah, 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 blah. Anyway, so really easy call booking. Glad to get got that done. She looks like a good prospect too. Like you can usually tell by the profile pictures. Like sometimes there's those low quality profile pictures of someone like smiling like this or something. You just know that they're not going to be a good, a good prospect. Um, but she, she had a pretty good looking um, profile picture, like good quality, good lighting, all of that. So hopefully she closes. Okay, it's about five o'clock now. So I've got a bit of time. I'm going to go treadmill again. Uh, I've just got a lot of energy and I don't know what else to do. So I might as well just go and run on the treadmill. Uh, go do that for an hour, half an hour, an hour, something like that. And then come back, read, eat dinner, and get back to work. Yeah. <sighs> that was intense. I did like five minute warm up, like five kilometer an hour speed. And then for the other 25 minutes I did 14 k's an hour so that's like what a seven kilometer run in half an hour not bad i need to go home swim and read Whew, that swim is good refreshed now and ready to get back in action i'll sat outside 
there on the grass and the sun for a bit, which was really good. Regenerate. Mm. Okay, one thing I've decided to start doing is I'm going to read the comments on my videos in the evening and just kind of respond to what you guys have said because I know when I reply in the comments it's not really like in-depth because I don't have a lot of time on my hands so let's go have a look see what yesterday's comments are looking like so Anthony first of all Anthony you've commented on every single one of my videos since I started releasing them so that's dedication I, I appreciate the support so he says 80s music is fire yes it is it's all I listen to I'm pretty sure your mom and your brother appreciate you a lot Great job on doing what you do for them. Thank you, I appreciate that. Rob says, productive day for you, James. Great talk. Yeah, it was a pretty productive day. Five calls booked. Today I haven't got five calls booked yet. Then Reho7387, you also comment on quite a few of my videos, so shout out to you. Glad to see you're expanding your view of yourself rather than just above your chest. Thank you, I appreciate it. And to be honest, my physique's not that good yet. And then user MD4S says, hey, I got a worm-like scar on my upper arm. Someone pushed me and I fell. I'm a biologist, but really just want to have fun. Yeah, I don't think biologist and fun belong in the same sentence. <laughs> Great channel, I love it. You've got more energy and enthusiasm than I do, hopefully. Yeah, honestly, I think it's just in the videos where the energy and enthusiasm comes out because otherwise, it's not really, but yeah, I guess you could say I've got quite a lot of enthusiasm and energy. I'm fixing it into me too to get close to yours. Cool. Um, I'm going to make this like a daily thing just after supper. I'm just going to read the comments that you guys have left on the video before uh, just so I can kind of interact with you guys. And of course, you can feel free to leave any questions you have. Um, and I'll be happy to answer them because I have a pretty questionable lifestyle. So, yeah, make this a daily thing. Okay, supper time's over, so I'm putting this phone away. Ah, it's a good cup of tea. All right, putting this away, getting to the reading, and then more work. Okay, now we're on two calls book for the day. Not bad. Okay, I'm gonna end it off right here. Pretty good day. Only got two calls booked though, unfortunately, just because today's been manic and there's just been many conversations going on at once. So it was quite hard to escalate all of them. But anyways, awaiting on a lot of people's times and information. So hopefully those get in tomorrow. <clears throat> but you can go like, subscribe, comment, follow me on Instagram and I'll see you guys tomorrow.